What's up guys and welcome back to another video right onto my YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna basically tell you how to fix your sound in World of Warcraft. So this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial, so stick to the end guys. In the end you will perfectly know what to do in order to fix this issue or these issues. Before we start right into the video, I just want to you guys know, let you guys know that I would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like, a comment or a subscription right onto my YouTube channel. It would really make my day and help me out as a little YouTuber as I am. Especially subscribing would be a big support for me. I mean, it's free for you guys and you would support my little my work on YouTube a little bit and uh, Support my journey here and I'm gonna be really thankful for that I'm gonna say thank you for that right now and I would just say let's get started So the first step, step is obviously if you have a USB port for your headset or your mic uh, I want you to unplug it and plug it in on another USB port because sometimes it could happen that your USB port is the, uh, is the reason why your sound is broken so just do that, but we're not gonna leave it like that. You, we're gonna obviously do something more. So um, next step is gonna be to go to the bottom left corner of your screen, opening up your settings. Once you're here, I want you to click the very first one so where it says system and click to the second one where it says sound. So as you can see, um, you have your output and your input device. I'm gonna start with your output device. The first thing you're gonna check is basically uh, which one you're using. So if you're using the right one and if your master volume is on the, um, yeah, it's perfect for you. Next step is gonna be to, you can click to troubleshoot to uh, see if Windows finds uh, some errors, you can do that. Next step is gonna be to click on device properties and uh, um, you need to uh, look at this one. So if it is disabled, if it's not disabled, go to the right hand side click on additional power settings or the device set, uh, device properties, I'm sorry. And uh, again, device usage, use this device. Levels, you need to uh, just put it there where, where you want it. And on advanced, you need to check for your own audio channel. So I can't really say just use this or that, uh, just you need to check it for your system specifically. So once you're finished here, you can go back and do the same thing for your input device. So again, choose your input device, look, one, uh, look which one you want to use. Um, once you, you uh, check that, you can go to troubleshoot if Windows, find, Windows finds some errors. Um, then you need to click on device properties. Again, look if it's disabled. You can also start a test. Additional device properties. Look on device usage if this device is enabled. Uh, click onto levels, look if it's working or the levels are right. And on advanced, you need to check for your own audio channel. Yeah, guys, that's it for the video. I hope I could actually help you out of this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment, or a subscription. I'm really gonna be thankful for that. I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but this fixed it for me and for many others, and I'm just gonna do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you in the next one, and bye.